Yo, what's up, broskies? LNP, and I wanted to do a quick review of a movie I went to see yesterday with my friend. Uh, it's called In Time, the new Justin Bieber. Just Justin Bieber. <laughs> I mean, Justin Timberlake movie. Uh, it's pretty good. Uh, what I thought about the movie was it's kind of um, a cool, uh, so to say, uh, idea. You know, like running out of time, and you know, basically the movie is like you know. You, Instead of currency, you have time. You know, it's kind of like your how long you can live. Uh, basically, they have like a time on their arm. Uh, you know, they can like you know get more time by working. Uh, for example, you know, you get like one day worth of time, and you know it'll cost you like uh, thirty minutes to do something. Uh, you know, to buy something or things like that. You know, that's how it works. It's pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Um, it, it the movie, the story is kind of really interesting. You know, it goes really well. Uh, and Justin Timberlake plays really well, and it, it gets really good until a certain part in the movie where I thought, what is going on? Uh, in the part of the movie where he, he gets like these, you know, he, Justin Timberlake sort of, it's kind of like the poor rich story, you know, like for a few people to be mortal, some must die and stuff like that, you know, it's... Uh, so he goes basically. The story is, you know, uh, he he gets, you know, some guy, you know, and then he gets more time and stuff, and then he's like, I'm gonna pay, make them pay, you know, the people who are the rich. He's gonna kind of go steal from him and stuff like that. That's the story basically. And the weird part kind of gets where um, he ends up um, basically kind of kidnapping the rich, rich person's daughter. And all of a sudden, the daughter just, like, turns on his dad. I mean, she starts stealing from his dad. Like, she just turns into a brat. Like, out of nowhere. Like, it's not like her dad was terrible. It's not like her dad was beating her up. It's not like her dad was, like, a bad dad. He gave her everything she wanted. And all of a sudden, she just turns on him. I'm like, is that the best thing they can do? Just, like, some kind of brat just completely turns on her father. Uh, <clears throat> but apparently, you know, her, her her father stole from the people and she saw them die or something. I guess it's like that. So she realises what her dad was doing wrong and kind of is, oh, I'm going to revenge them or for your father and whatnot. So they're just, um, it's kind of weird like that, but I guess they, they, they're kind of like, um, the story is like, um, uh, you know, Robin. Uh, the story of Robin, you know, he would steal from the rich, give to the poor. Uh, that's what this, that's what they basically do: steal from the rich, give to the poor, which basically is time. They steal time for people to get more time so they can live and have more fun. Uh, but the moral of the story is, you know, how depending how much time they steal, people still are gonna die. Um, but um, nobody should be immortal. That's the idea of the film. So I guess uh, it just make it kind of makes you think of your time and how you spend it, and you know, it just kind of. It's kind of weird, interesting. Uh, if you're thinking of seeing this film, I would recommend it. It's it's pretty good. Um, there's some parts that are a little bit stupid, but the story and the actors play pretty well. You know, there's some twists and stuff like that. You know, it's not not nothing exactly too bad. But there was this one part in the movie which looked absolutely terrible, which was like this CGI with this car kind of flipped, and it's probably one of the worst fucking editing I've ever seen in a film. It it just looked like I was like. What the fuck just happened? It was really bad. I mean, it was it was it was embarrassing bad. But overall, the movie was pretty good. I'd recommend it. Uh, but um, if you want to see some other movies, I would say maybe go see Red Steel, or like Real Steel or something. That's a good movie. I'm, I haven't personally seen it, but I think Real Steel would be more interesting if you're going to see um, In Time and you know you're kind of like oh I don't know which one to go. I'd recommend go to it probably red steel no well real steel why do i call it red steel but it's everything so, so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video